Day 13 will be our last day in Los Angeles. We'll be looking in this area, seeing the La Brea Tar Pits, and then going over to Madame Tussauds to see the Wax Museum of the Stars. We have now arrived in the museum area of the city. Over there on the left, that red and white building, is the Peterson's Automotive Museum, and to the right we have the Modern Art Museum with the streetlight installation. Behind us is the La Brea Tar Pits. We've come to look at the La Brea Tar Pits and Museum. It's a rather large area with several tar pits scattered out throughout the park. We're going to be looking in this area at the Lake Pit and also at the museum. There's an oil field underneath here that produces tar pits on the surface. A new TV series about La Brea is about this and a sinkhole that forms here. There's also a movie called Volcano where a volcano erupts right in the middle of Los Angeles. This lake was formed when they dug tar out of this area, creating a pit that later filled with water. It has an oily sheen on it because the oil is still bubbling up from that oil field underneath here and it creates that rotten egg smell that you'll be smelling. You see them bubbling up? Here's a picture of how the tar pit forms from the oil underneath. We're waiting to get into the museum and see the George C. Page Museum of La Brea Discoveries. The around the top shows the scene as what it would have looked like back when there were tar pits here and the animals were getting caught. Often mammals would be caught and predators would attack them and they would get caught also. A block was removed from pit 81 and this is what it would look like if the tar was clear. You can see how many fossils. Here's a Harlan ground sloth. And of course, Deborah touches anytime she can. This one actually let her touch. Many different animals have been found in the pit. Here are a few of them. Here's a look at some of the different types of animals that were found here from foxes and mountain lions only. This extinct camel was twice the size of the one we have today. Dire wolves were the most common animals found. Hundreds of skulls have been found. They seem to get hung up pretty easily. garden in the courtyard is a replica of what plants might have been here during the time that the tar pits were collecting animals.
And now it's time to head down to downtown Hollywood and look at the Madame Tussaud Wax Museum. Where La Brea crosses Hollywood Avenue, we find the four silver ladies. These are to represent the four ethnicities of the people who starred in movies. Mae West and Dolores Del Rio, Dorothy Dandridge and Anna Mae Wong. And then as we drive down Hollywood Boulevard, we come to Madame Tussauds. And there we'll be parking underneath Madame Tussauds and going to the museum. Let's look at some of the people we see here. After the discussion about life being a box of chocolates, it's time for us to head back to the hotel for the night. And this brings us to the end of day 13, our last day in Los Angeles.